What is going on Facebook? This is my name is Jess and welcome back to a new video. First of all, I hope you had a really great Thanksgiving for all the Americans watching. I uh, hope you had some great time with your family. I hope you had some great Thanksgiving dinner. But now it's time to get back on track. We're starting today with a Snapchat Q&A. If you didn't know already, we opened a Snapchat for Face Fitness. It is face underscore fitness. Uh, so make sure you add it to one. We're planning on having different face members take over. Doing workouts, doing live things, and doing Snapchat Q&As like this. Okay, so let's get right started. I asked you guys to send me videos, so uh, we'll see. Let's get right into the questions. Okay, the first one is from Luke. Why is face a doctor scrub? <laughs> okay, that wasn't very nice. Nesbit has four questions. What really inspired you to work out? I, I always wanted to get bigger because I did, never felt like I was like I looked cool or I looked like a, a man, you know, so that inspired me to get into the gym What type of accent do you have? What type of accent do I have? I'm Dutch, so I kind of have like a Dutch English accent, I guess Which one should, should I do first, cardio or weights? What should you do first, cardio or weights? Well, that I think that depends on your goals um, If you want to um, lose weight. I suggest you do cardio first. Uh, you always want to do. You put your all, all your all of your energy, the most of the energy, put into the first thing. So um, obviously, if you want to build some muscle, you want to do um, some weights first because all your energy is going goes in there, and you can finish off with some cardio if you want to. But um, if you want to lose weight, put all your energy in the cardio and then do a little bit of weights. All right, Nick. How did you find face fitness, and what made you start? Okay, this I, I guess this is right, redirected to me. How did I find face fitness? Um, well, it didn't exist um, back in the day when um, last year actually, um, last year when I was with Sensei, uh, we um, were planning on setting it up. Uh, I was supposed to be helping him with that, uh, which I'm still doing. So um, shout out to Sensei. How many times do you work out a day, and for how many hours? Um, so how many times a day? I work out once a day, I, never, I did twice once and it was not good, so I don't recommend that. Um, put your heart in those one, one and a half hours, so I work out one hour to one and a half hours max. When you're alone, an hour is enough. Um, when you're with maybe two or three people, even an uh, hour, an hour and a half, obviously it's going to take a little bit longer. Do you play CSGO? Nope. Jasper, what is your favorite meal before a workout? Phase up. Phase up, homie. Oh, hey, didn't see you there. What is your favorite type of gamma? Okay, my f okay, yeah, that's two questions. That's awesome. Tyler, uh, you're awesome. Um, favorite um, gamma flavor, face berry, obviously. Um, and the first question was, what I, oh yeah, um, I always eat rice and chicken and some broccoli or rice, chicken and beans and a banana and that's my pre-workout and that's it. So that's what I kind of always eat before the gym. Um, some energy thing. Bananas are really nice. Uh, you get some good energy from it, some natural sugars, um, some carbs, obviously, because that um, energizes you, the carbs. So that's the rice. And then the chicken um, to add some protein and some flavor. And obviously, the greens, it's good for your health, good micronutrients. So um, it's basically what I eat before my workouts. Okay. If you could pick one job of your choice, what would it be and why? This. Easy money. This is the easiest question for me ever. Uh, I would do this. Making YouTube videos and helping other people work out and chase their dreams. Just like I am doing right now. So thank you. I want to turn how much do you love face and fitness? Bro. Do you see my outfit? Face up, bro. All day. Question two. Face Sensei. How do you come up with your name? Okay, I can answer that for Sensei because Sensei is not here, obviously. Um, unfortunately, Sensei came up with his name because he's an actual Sensei. Uh, and sensei means that I think it's a fourth degree black belt in ma mixed martial arts. Um, so he's obviously uh, he's teaching other people uh, martial arts. So he's a, like a real Sensei. Uh, ooze. That's why he says ooze all the time. What are some foods to gain muscle mass? What are you ever thought about competing? Okay, competing, uh, yes, I want to do it in like two years or something. I want to build a good foundation. And when I want to enter, I want to win. So I don't want to enter if I don't feel like I can win. Second uh, question, what's some good foods to eat to gain muscle? Well, obviously you want some uh, high protein foods. So like chicken, or fish, 
nuts. Stuff has protein in it. Protein basically um, helps you gain muscle, so um, foods with high, high in protein. What's it like being in the face house? Uh, I'm not there, but it was cool. I was there for three weeks back in April and May. Um, awesome. Really, really great guys. The face guys, uh, the top of the line looks. Yeah, yes, they're just wondering how tall are each members of the face fitness? Of the face, I'm 5'7", 5'8", 5'7 and a half, something like that. I'm really small. I'm like, I'm with Apex, so, you know, we're homies. Um, Sensei is like a little bit taller. I think he's like 6 foot, 6 foot 1. I'm sorry if I got it wrong, Sensei. Also, how many exercises for shoulders, bicep, and triceps do you do? Like, 4 or 5 exercises with 4 sets? Okay, so he asks, um... How many exercises I do on a training day for shoulders, triceps, and biceps? So usually for shoulders I do like three or four, so one or two compound movements. So that means like barbell press and dumbbell press, and then accessory movements like side raises, rear delt raises, for traps, front raises, something like that. So like four, I think four, yeah. Biceps, I usually do two or three. Same with triceps. So um, with biceps, I do one compound movement as well, like normal barbell curl. Um, triceps, I do the close grip bench press or dips. Um, that's a compound movement. And then the accessory, like uh, just a normal pull, push down or a normal curl, hammer curls, across body, whatever, something like that. Happy games giving. <laughs> I love that, dude. What is the best workout for a 13 year old boy? For a 13 year old, I suggest you do um, some home workouts, some uh, push-ups, some pull-ups, maybe some sit-ups, some um, maybe some light bicep curls, stuff like that. Not too, not too crazy. You have all the time in the world to to go in the gym. Uh, most of the gyms don't even let people under 16 in. So um, if you're 13 and you want to work out, do something at home. We have a, a home workout playlist. Um, yeah, maybe we can help you out with that. What do you prefer? Lifting weights or body weight training? I'm more of a weight lifting guy. Um, I do like body weights, but I'm more of a weight lifting guy. Sensei, uh, on the other hand, uh, Sensei is more of a, a calisthenics guy. He likes to do the body weight things, the pull ups and uh, um, push up variations and the human flags and stuff. So it's really cool. It's awesome to see people do it. It's really, really hard. Hey, Face Fitness, how do you keep motivated by, like, you know, trying your best, working hard, like, every single day in the gym? Like, how do you, like, keep motivated? Like, I just need some tips on being motivated all day. Okay, so motivation, as Sensei always says, motivation you cannot buy, you cannot get, um, you have to have it. It, it. it comes from you, it comes from the heart, um, that motivation, that drive to do something, right? So, um, if you want to get good at a game, um, your motivation is to get good at the games, play it a lot, and you want to, that's the motivation to play. Same with going to the gym. If you really want to change your body, uh, losing weight, getting muscle, anything you want, then you're going to need to go to the gym. So that should be your motivation, you know. Your motivation should be working towards that goal or towards that, towards this month, towards, you know. I, I spoke to someone who wants to um, be in top shape um, because, uh, she hadn't seen her dad in a while um, and she wants to train for that. So that's great motivation. You find something uh, in your life that you want to change, um, set a goal and work towards that and that should be your motivation. Hi, face big fan. Hey Ben, what's up? Better for you, pull-ups, sit-ups or push-ups. Which is better for you, pull-ups, sit-ups or push-ups? They're all really good for you. I cannot choose one because they're all different. One for abs, one for back and one is for chest, triceps. So I cannot choose one. What do you think is the best way to make more mass? To gain mass, the easiest and best way to do it is one, eat a lot, two, train very, very hard, three, stay consistent. Three easy steps. Eat a lot, train hard, stay consistent. And the mass will come over time. It's not something you do in a couple weeks. It's not something you're gonna do in a couple months, a couple years, it's a lot of change. So go into it like it's a life change and you will get the mass you want. Have a happy Saturday. Enjoy your weekends. Make sure to go to the gym and reach your goals. We're happy to have you here. Thank you so much for watching. Leave a thumbs up on the video and we'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.